you have new challenges today. Sensitive data is transmitted over encrypted channels. Often the information you want is not transmitted at all. Your target may be outside your monitoring domain. Is passive monitoring enough? You need more. You want to look through your target's eyes. You have to hack your target. Let's say the device is a, uh, a computer. You'd be able to uh, see all of the keystrokes you know, that uh, the uh, operator uh, used. You'd be able to go into their uh, memory, find out what do documents were stored there, what information is available on that machine. If they used uh, Skype, you'd be able to monitor that call. You'd be able to turn on the camera or the microphone when the subject was unaware of it and hear and see what was going on in front of the computer all of those kinds of capabilities. So it's, it's quite, I mean, it's a very powerful system. And uh, as I say, I recognize that a lot of people find that to be perhaps uh, frightening, but it's also a capability that's available from uh, other, to, to the bad guys. <laughs> you know, it can be done not just by us, it's available on uh, various, you know, black internet sites that uh, provide these kinds of capabilities to uh, criminals and terrorists. And if it's installed on my device, I will not find, find out. Um, that's certainly the objective of hacking team, to make sure that whoever is using, uh, is the subject of the investigation, is unaware that it's being used against them. And how do you sort of get your software to run on all different platforms? So are they, these all different products from, from hacking team? Well, yeah, it has to be configured for the particular operating system or device that's being used, and there are Hacking Team offers a variety of um, applications that work on all the major platforms. So for instance, there comes out a new patch for my um, uh, Internet Explorer or, or Windows uh, 8. Does that mean that Hacking Team also has developed a new patch for it to work on that new it may, platform? It may very well mean that, yeah. It sort of depends on what, you know, what exactly has been developed, but certainly a new device, new operating system, something like that would require extra work uh, from hacking team. And this is sort of an ongoing process. You know, you have virus detection software that's constantly evolving. And so, you know, the, the tools that we offer have to be, you know, evolving also in order to deal with that. In tegenlicht grof dienen aan veiligheidslekken en een bewust hackende overheid.